such a good workout. It's honestly nice when there's like not a lot of people in the gym. So I can just kind of like float around and do whatever I want. And it is such a nice day today. I like got outside this morning when I woke up. And it was like already in the 80s at like 9 a.m. <laughs> and the sun just felt so good so i'm definitely gonna go to the pool today but i need a shower i want to make some egg bites i've been telling myself i'm gonna make them and i like have all the ingredients to make them and i've just been putting it off and i really want some so i think i'm gonna make some after i jump out of the shower and then i'm going to head to the pool and enjoy some sun Okay, I changed my mind. I'm not gonna make egg bits right now. I just realized it's already 12 and I want to just kind of get the day started. So I'm gonna make something to eat just for right now. I realized that my videos have been not in the best lighting all the time. So we have a light and it's blending this shit out of me. <laughs> but I want you guys to be able to see me. I just got out of the shower and I realized when I was in the shower that I really do need to take care of my nervous system today with my spiritual health. Right before I got in the shower, I just felt my nervous system just on overdrive and I took that as a sign to sit in silence and i realized what had triggered that was me scrolling on my phone we need to not do that anymore it's easier said than done i know we all do it as much as i say it's so important to be productive i definitely catch myself scrolling from time to time and it just completely drains the crap out of me i know sometimes we think that scrolling or maybe subconsciously we think that scrolling is like a way to kind of escape the world and like relax or decompress and honestly that's not always the best way. I don't think it's a good way at all actually. <laughs> and as somebody that does not watch the news, I have found that social media is like a whole brand new form of news and it's just a new way of consuming things that we usually wouldn't want to consume. Just be conscious of the things that you consume in your life and make sure you are creating more than you are consuming. With that said, I'm just gonna do my, I don't even do my hair, just brush it a little bit and I'm gonna get into meditation. I would usually do this outside on my balcony just because I like to work with any type of plant medicine outside. I don't know why, I just feel more connected and um, at one with nature and it's like peaceful. But right now, intuitively, I feel like I need a break from <laughs> the stimulation of like the outside world and I need to kind of just go inwards and be in my own room. So uh, that's what we're gonna do.
this medicine to help others heal. renewed after that ceremony I just had I just feel so much better instantly I felt so much better <laughs> right when I started the ceremony I like dropped into like the deepest meditation like I felt like I was brought back into my body and there was a mantra that came through that was returning to myself returning to god returning to myself returning to god and that's like literally i just kept going through my head the whole time and i just feel so much more grounded right now so much more in my body and when i like dropped into my meditation i just felt like there was just silence and it was weird because i could hear like honking horns and stuff but the only thing that i was focusing on was the birds that were chirping outside and it wasn't even that loud but it was almost like returning back to that that still place and tuning back into nature and that's exactly what i was tuned into was i was just listening to the birds and everything else was just blocked out i'm so grateful <laughs> for this medicine that i've been introduced to i feel like it's just been such a huge game changer in my healing journey actually really good we were kind of well my boyfriend was sad because they were supposed to have sushi at least that's what they said online but they didn't have any so he didn't get to get any sushi i'm not a big sushi girl so i ended up just getting a burger with no bun since i don't eat gluten and then um fry or truffle flies and they were so good the burger was a little honestly i wasn't a big fan they had like i didn't even know it came with cheese but it had like this melted cheese on it and i wasn't that into it but it was overall really good oh you want to come say hello no <laughs> i need to do the dishes
ordering out and my boyfriend ended up getting some sushi. I'll probably have a bite or two, even though I'm not a big sushi girl. Um, and I got some fresh kitchen as I usually do. I get their almond chicken with their broccoli, chickpeas, sweet potato noodles. Uh, I think that's all that's in here. Mm. Mm. That one's a spike bowl, I don't cook. You like that? Is it fishy? Mm-mm. Thank you.